the CBS 17 Storm Team. Well, a cold front and good rain chances are headed here this weekend, but Florence remains at the top of everyone's mind, and it's the first thing we're going to talk about tonight. Good evening. I'm Wes Owenstein, and thanks for watching CBS 17. So throughout the day today, Florence has remained rather disorganized, and tonight the latest from the National Hurricane Center keeps it as a tropical storm with 65 mile per hour winds. And while the last 24 hours have involved a lot of weakening, that has now stopped, and going forward, it'll most likely strengthen into a hurricane again while it is currently some 1,600 miles away from the North Carolina coast. This is the latest track on where it could be by this Wednesday afternoon, just off the North Carolina coast, possibly as a category four hurricane with 130 mile per hour winds. Where it goes after that is still very much up in the air. It could still turn to the north. It could come directly into the mid-Atlantic. It could still veer more to the south. Coming up a little later, we're going to look at the trends and what the possibilities are for us later next week. But Florence has company now with Tropical Depression 9 and Tropical Depression 8 even farther out in the open waters of the Atlantic. 